Hi, it's Debbie again. I hope that you're doing well. Just kind of fluffing with my hair a little bit. I actually have a topper on. Um, I will show that in a video some day soon. Um, I know I have had a request from, um, I can't remember her name. I'll put it down below. Uh, today's video is going to be a little different. It's not necessarily about beauty. It's not a, necessarily about my health. But I want to talk to you. Um, and do sort of a tag that I've seen, but it's not really questions. It's what I would say to my teenage or I'm going to extend it teenage to like early twenties self. Um, now that I am 52 years, 52 years old, um, I've lived a little bit more life than I did when I was a, a teenager and in my early 20s and so um, what would I say to myself okay uh, one of the things that I would say to myself and this might sound silly but it is so important and as now as I'm older and I'm really into skincare uh, so much more than I was when I was a teenager in my early 20s going to the clubs dancing and stuff getting up you know not having any sleep and going to work in the morning, but I did it, you know. Uh, wash your face. Take the makeup off. If you forget to moisturize a few times, that's fine. Um, we sort of do live in a more advanced, well, we definitely live in a more advanced world now. There's products that you can have like and keep at your nightstand uh, if, if you're really tired when you're coming home and you know you just got a few hours to sleep before you have to work um, keep some cleansing uh, cloths that you really like uh, some micellular water something but take that makeup off sleeping with your makeup is the worst thing you can do it clogs your pores it makes your pores bigger and it'll cause more problems for you when you're older and that's that really I can't say that enough another thing I would say is that if you meet a guy and he doesn't take time to be with you or take you out or call you and he has excuse after excuse um, don't believe all the excuses he like that famous book and movie he's just not that into you and I know it's really hard. Um, I have been in that place before when I was uh, younger where I was head over heels for someone and the return calls never happened and you know he didn't take time to be with you. Um, in any relationship, a man or a woman, whatever, the, the person you're interested, if they are into you, they will make time. There is no, like, meeting in the morning or they have to, you know, mow their parents' lawn. You'll be worth it for them to miss that meeting or be a little later mowing the lawn, if that's true. Um, value. Value yourself. And that's another one. Um, don't do anything that you wouldn't do if everyone was watching you um, have confidence in yourself but don't think that just because you're interested in a guy or you're interested in a girl and they want you to do something that you're not comfortable with don't do it it, it just don't it, it they're not worth it guy girl not worth it Okay, um, other things, um, don't worry about everyone liking you. If you are yourself and if you, you know, pay attention to other people and you notice their hobbies and you talk about them and you talk about yourself, that's all you need to do, you know, um, don't, don't worry if not everybody in the world likes you. The nicest, most greatest people in the world have people that don't like them. And it's okay. I think that's one thing you learn as you get older. 
we would like everyone to like us, but not everybody's going to, you know. As long as you're a good person and you uh, have a, you know, a decent way about you, if you understand that, um, you'll be fine. You know, I, this is one that I've always felt, even when I was younger, I would rather have one person that was the best friend in the world and could trust with all my wishes and secrets than have 40 that I couldn't trust with anything. Um, another one that I can think of is um, if you think this is the, you know, you're going through a hard time, don't think that that's the end of it all. Hard times in life, they come. Life is kind of like a roller coaster. It has ups and downs and ups and downs. And sometimes we are in valleys. And when we're in valleys, we need to just pick ourselves up and get up that mountain or get up that roller coaster because that bad time will be in the past someday. And, you know, you probably hear from your parents or somebody older that you know that, Oh, years from now, you'll just laugh about this. You will. You will. Um, another one is to appreciate the people that are good to you. Appreciate the people that are in your life and that take time to be kind to you. And then um, I'm trying to think of more with like makeup. Um, one thing is I could say was a mistake I made well into my 30s is don't be so hard on yourself about your complexion there are some girls that and and guys too that you know they'll have a little spot and and they they just pack on the foundation they pack on the concealer go lightly at it you know you have young beautiful skin you don't have lines and you know I appreciate my skin for my age, but I know that when I was younger and I didn't have little signs of aging, there was always something I was picking at. You're young. Enjoy that, you know. And uh, I think that's about it for now because I don't want to make it a long video. These are just some things that I would, <coughs> pardon me, I would say to my teenage and early 20s self. Um... Yeah, and enjoy your life. Uh, life is a wonderful gift, and I'm not getting religious with you, but enjoy your life, and as Ellen De DeGeneres says, be good to people. They'll be good back to you, and if they're not, other people will. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. If you've come across my video and you're not subscribed, just hit that subscribe button. It'll help me out. Uh, if you want to give this a thumbs up and share it, that's great too. I don't always mention that. I feel like in every video I don't want to. I, I don't want to seem like I'm like begging, but I just kind of like to mention it. Um, I did take a little bit of a break. Um, it wasn't all health things it was um you know i just wanted to enjoy the holidays and they were wonderful so i hope that you are having a great start to your new year and i will see you soon and thanks for watching i hope that you have a great morning afternoon evening night whatever whatever time of day you're watching this take care of yourselves and i'll see you soon Bye bye